is on his knees, and I'm, I'm, I got this hook inside, right? And then my knee, I want to make sure to keep my knee to the outside. If my knee starts to float on the inside, all he has to do is drop his chest on it, and he'll start to smash me and pass. So I got to make sure that I keep this knee on the outside the whole time. Once I get this in here, I'm going to scoot around and just get a hold of his belt or whatever I can grab over here. All right? I want to be on this side as much as possible. Now, he's going to start maybe reaching with this arm or whatever. When he does, I'm just going to grab, grab a hold of his arm so he can't post. All right? My head's going to go in his chest and I'd rather be on the, uh, the rather than on, on this side, over closer to this side. And my head is in front of my hips. So I'm going to roll to my shoulder and then I'm going to get up on my toes, kick him over. If I can go to the mount, I'll just float right over to the mount. And, and, and sweeping from there. All right. So again, <coughs> I got this hook in. I want my knee out. I like to scoot around. It makes it easier for me to get this hook. I like to get it around his waist. Sometimes uh, he may be posting the hand on the mat. If he does, I'll just grab it, suck it in. As I suck it in, I just roll on my head, my shoulder, kick him off. If I kick him off, I can go to side control, or I can just float right over into the mouth. All right, so one more time. Start with the hook, grab, grab. If I can tuck this under my armpit, it's even better. See my head, my, my head's here. I go to my shoulder, boom, boom, boom. I drive over the top, and then I end up in the mouth. Or I can end up in side control, just depending. On, on what you do. All right? Sir. Let's work it. Ready? Oh.